Good morning, everybody. Thank you for joining me today for story time. Are you guys enjoying all this really nice weather, warm weather? Spring is coming. It's on its way. How exciting. So we are going to be starting our spring story time session. So our books will kind of be revolving around spring. And this week, our theme is frogs. And I have some frog books over here. And there are also frog crafts at the Oaks Bightman Memorial Library and the Troy Miami County Public Library. And if you get your books from the Bookmobile, they'll have some frog crafts as well. So I have a new song for us this spring session, and it is Five Green and Speckled Frogs. Now I've done this song before, so we'll jump right in. And if you don't know it, I'm sure you'll learn it after the first couple of frogs. So let's go ahead and do our song. Ready? Five green and speckled frogs sat on a speckled log eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are four green speckled frogs. Glump, glump. So let's count them. One, two, three, four. Four green and speckled frogs sat on a speckled log eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are three green speckled frogs. Glump, glump. One, two, three. Three green and speckled frogs sat on a speckled log eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are two green speckled frogs. Glump, glump. Only two left. One, two. Two green and speckled frogs sat on a speckled log eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there's just one green speckled frog. Glump, glump. Just one little guy left. Ready? One green and speckled frog sat on a speckled log eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are no green speckled frogs. Glump, glump. No more in the log. They all jumped into the water. Well, since we've done our song, we'll go ahead and we'll read our book. And our book is Dog on a Frog. What? Is that dog sitting on a frog? He sure is. Let's go ahead and we'll read our book. Dog on a Frog by Cass and Claire Gray, illustrated by Jim Field, published by Scholastic Press. Hey dog, get off the frog, said Frog. But I like sitting on frogs, said the dog. Frogs are squishy and squashy, and when you sit on them, they go grok. You know the rules, said the cat. Cats sit on mats, frogs sit on logs, and dogs sit on frogs. Well, I'm changing the rules, said the frog. From now on, dogs sit on logs, not frogs. Really, said the dog. Really, said the frog. So dogs sit on logs and cats sit on gnats. Ouch! Well, what will bears sit on, asked the dog. Bears will sit on stairs, said the frog. What will slugs sit on, asked the dog. Slugs will sit on plugs, said the frog. Slugs will sit on plugs. Flies will sit on pies. Crickets will sit on tickets. And moths will sit on cloths. What will leopards sit on, asked the dog. Leopards will sit on shepherds, said the frog. Leopards will sit on shepherds, and cheetahs will sit on fajitas. You're really getting the hang of this, said the dog. I know, said the frog, and that's not all. 
Newes will sit on canoes, pigs will sit on wigs, and boars will sit on oars. What will whales sit on? asked the dog. Whales will sit on nails, said the frog. I'm not sure the whales will like that, said the dog. They don't have to like it, said the frog. They just have to do it. What will dragons sit on, asked the dog. Dragons will sit on wagons, said the frog. Dragons will sit on wagons. Mice will sit on ice. Kittens will sit on mittens. And puppies will sit on guppies. What will canaries sit on, asked the dog. Canaries will sit on fairies, said the frog. Canaries will sit on fairies. Possums will sit on blossoms. Hens will sit on pens. Baboons will sit on balloons. And poodles will sit on noodles. Poodles aren't going to like sitting on noodles, gasped the dog. They are now, the frog smiled. Hold on, said the cat. If dogs sit on logs and cats sit on gnats, bears sit on stairs, slugs sit on plugs, flies sit on pies, crickets sit on tickets, moths sit on cloths, leopards sit on shepherds, cheetahs sit on fajitas, news sit on canoes, pigs sit on wigs, boars sit on oars, whales sit on nails, dragons sit on wagons, mice sit on ice, Kittens sit on mittens, puppies sit on guppies, canaries sit on fairies, possums sit on blossoms, hens sit on pins, baboons sit on balloons, and poodles sit on noodles. What are frogs going to sit on? asked the dog. These, said the frog. Hmm... Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed our silly story about dog on a frog. That silly frog, he was saying all those different animals are sitting on silly things. What do you guys sit on? Do you guys sit on chairs? Do you guys sit on frogs? Do you sit on dogs? What do you guys sit on? Well, I hope that you guys enjoy the rest of your day. Don't forget to stop by the library and get some books, get a craft, and I hope to see you guys soon. Bye-bye.